everyone, so this video is just a little kind of updatey vlog type of thing because all the videos you've seen up till this point from the beginning of December were pre-recorded um, scheduled videos because I was really busy and I was also away during the end of um, December and the beginning of January so kind of around Christmas time I was away as well and I'm back now. So I wanted to just get kind of a little update video and talk to you about a couple of little things and just catch up really because I didn't want to kind of launch right into filming a regular video um, because I haven't filmed for such a long time. I thought it might be a bit weird so I thought I'd ease my way into it. So I'm sat comfortably and I've got my tea here. I've got green tea in this mug and I'm just going to chat to you a little bit and update you with a few stuff. So the first thing is I got my hair cut while I was away. Um, I kept meaning to get it cut and I wasn't happy with kind of any of the consultations that I had and I take it very very seriously getting my hair cut um, because it's curly and it can be a bit problematic to cut it and kind of get the cut perfect and that was my phone going off. Um, but also I wanted my friend to cut it. I've got a lovely friend back home who usually cuts it and she um, does, it a really, does a really great job of it and she's done it for a long time so I wanted her to do it. So when I went back home I got her to cut it and this is kind of the result. Basically what I needed was I just wanted a few shorter layers put in and taken a little bit off the length. So I'm not sure how well you can kind of see um, because I'm sort of still... Um, I'm not sure how much of my head's in shot, but if I kind of just go up a little bit, you can see the length that the hair is here, and it's a little bit shorter, but I've also had shorter layers put through, so you can see kind of here, it just gives it a bit more body, and it's still kind of a little bit strange. Um, my hair just kind of feels a little bit weird, and I think it's a combination of the climate and that kind of thing, and the fact that I haven't dyed it for a really long time, it kind of makes it feel a bit um, flat sometimes, but I'm really happy with the cut and I need to kind of play around with it. Yesterday was the first day where I kind of used my regular products and saw what I thought and I'll still kind of play around with it. I might try diffusing it and see how that works out, but I have had it cut. I just asked her to put in shorter layers um, once you've taken off a little bit of the length and just trim the ends and that was basically all she did and I'm really happy with it. And the curls are kind of much more manageable, but still my hair kind of feels just a little bit thin and a little bit weird because... I'm not used to kind of styling it like this um, because it has been so long. So that's what I've been doing um, in terms of my haircut. Then also in terms of my channel, I've been thinking a lot about kind of differences I want to make this year and things that I want to kind of approach differently and that kind of thing. And I've decided that maybe it would be um, a better idea for me to kind of upload less often because I was putting myself under quite a lot of pressure last year to kind of get videos up. I tried to do it kind of five days a week and to get it really organized. But I think what I'm gonna try and do is aim for maybe like four non-consecutive days or maybe five if I've got like an outfit video because those are really easy to upload and to edit and everything and it just takes two minutes for me to film what I'm wearing so I'm going to try and do more of those but try and kind of do um, gaps in between the videos if that makes sense a little bit more so I will be starting to do that next week I've got a haul coming up that I'm going to go and attend to my phone because it's going to keep making that noise. So I'm going to go and see what that is. I can tell that I'm not used to filming because that wouldn't ordinarily happen. Normally I put my phone on silent when I'm filming because otherwise I'll suddenly get text messages and emails. My phone is just constantly going off with emails and it really, really disturbs me. So where was I? I think I was talking about filming, was I? I don't know what I was talking about. But... um yeah i'm gonna try and um upload kind of like that i was gonna try and kind of do set day set topics so kind of maybe have like a makeup monday um like a wait wednesday type of thing but i'm not sure if i'm gonna do that yet let me know if like you'd really like that just because it kind of puts pressure on me to come up with a particular topic for that particular day so i'm not sure if i'm gonna do that yet but i am gonna try and kind of do um videos like that because it's kind of more about the quality less about the quantity and I think I kind of was putting pressure on myself to kind of get a lot out last year um just because I'd gotten into the habit of doing it and I kind of thought I needed to and I don't so that's um that kind of thing as well um another thing I kind of want to try and do is definitely blog more I really really neglect it and it's terrible because I want to get reviews up and I write them and then I have to kind of 
crop the photos and things and I just don't get around to doing it and I really want to make sure that I'm writing more because I really love it and it's great to accompany YouTube because then I can kind of have reviews for you to go and look at um, cause obviously it's kind of diff more difficult to just do loads and loads of video reviews about a single product unless you particularly want me to um, let me know if like, you'd like to do though, that type of thing like a review video every week of a different product. I like to kind of do overview videos more because I just feel like it's kind of a bit of a waste to just do like a two minute video about a face wash but let me know what you think because obviously it's your opinion that matters because you're watching it and also I need to kind of try and um, ignore the negativity a bit because I feel like I don't respond to it too badly but I do always respond if someone's being negative I will have to respond and I don't think that that's very wise and I probably shouldn't be doing that and it's something that I've kind of really gotten into the habit of doing and it's just not very constructive so I want to try and just kind of ignore those comments or delete those comments because sometimes what happens is then you'll ignore it and then someone else will see it and jump to your defense and it ends up being an argument and I just don't want that kind of negativity I want it to be a nice happy positive place so I might try and do it like that but I have like I said got a bunch of videos coming up um, that are going to kind of be haul videos and that kind of thing, a couple of fashion videos. I'll obviously have quite a few Valentine's Day themed ones closer to the time as well, even though like we're only in January now, but closer to the time as well. And um, yeah, I will um, make sure as well that I um, am going to be better at linking things down below because I always forget that. So I want to try and do that and I just want to kind of um, be a bit more organized with my channel and do it a little bit more properly so i'm gonna go now because that's kind of all the updates i've got but there will be a haul up for you tomorrow with a bunch of stuff in it i've gotten quite a bit of shopping lately and um i've got some really cool things i want to share with you as well and as i said from next week i'll kind of organize the timing of videos and that kind of thing so let me know what days you think work best i don't know just kind of see what you prefer and um, I will talk to you soon. I'll talk to you in my next normal video which will probably be a little bit more together and a little bit more professional than this one. So yeah, I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next time.